Okay, so the good news is the octocopter is flying again, and it's actually flying with it with its uh, intended payload of 70 kilos. Uh, so that's good. Uh, the bad news is, as always, new trouble arises, and um, this time one of the piston rings uh, has gotten pinched in its um, in the track that where it rests. So uh, I lost compression on the um, right back motor, uh, so I have to make a forced landing, you will see it later on in the video clip. Uh, and you will not believe how many difficulties I have had to overcome just to get back to where I were uh, before last season's uh, severe accident. Um, it's like everything that can happen will, will happen. I have, have over excessively shrinking PVC fuel hoses, they shrink like more than 10%. So. Uh, they come loose and there's fuel all over and it's really exciting uh, and I have had uh, ground cables from the ignition system that uh, fails and um, the current finds its way back to the negative terminal of the battery via the uh, internal circuits of the servo uh, the throttle servos so so they're mechanically really good and the electric motor still works but the um, uh, integrated circuit in them are fried and that's just a few things uh, that have happened Really, it's really difficult to make all this technology of hobby grade quality uh, work together at the same time, at the same place. It's uh, really, really difficult. Uh, well, that's where I am today.